Hey everyone, it's Kim Jefferson and it's Wisdom Wednesday. <clears throat> and today I wanted to talk about what they call in Australia the tall poppy syndrome. And the tall poppy syndrome, if you think about, you have a whole field of poppies and there's one poppy that's sticking out and the rest are about here. They, people who are the smaller poppy want to try to bring you down to their level. So it could be you're having success in weight loss, you're having success in your job, you're having success in your life, and others around you aren't. And they try to bring you down to their level. And so that's what the Australians refer to as tall poppy syndrome. So I get this a lot with my clients, you know, as they start getting healthier, fitter, you know, people in their lives, family members, friends, what have you, start to make comments, either subtle or very not subtle, comments about their change. And most of the change comes from they're afraid that you are no longer going to need them. You're no longer going to have them in their lives. And it's not that it's that's the case. Sometimes it does happen. But for the most part, you might be changing more rapidly than they're able to keep up with. So I always say find ways that you can include people into your healthy lifestyle. So it could be going for walks after dinner. It could be, you know, instead of dramatically changing the way you eat, just subtly changing the way you eat uh, when you're at home or when you go out to places. So, you know, save those treat meals for when you are out with friends, because most of the time, it's them, it's not you. They, you know, if you're sitting there eating, you know, chicken and salad while they're like hamming down on a hamburger, they feel like there's judgment. And there's really no judgment. It's like, this is the choice you've made for your life. So you have to kind of sometimes bring your, your mindset down to where their mindset is. And then there are other people that you might just have to discard. There is a, a, a quote that I use all the time. You are the sum of the five people you surround yourself with. And take a look at your five people. Are they people who are your cheerleaders or are they people who are not your cheerleaders? And maybe it's time for you to have that conversation that you are making these changes and you want them to be a part of your life. And, you know, I know that conversation is hard. It's difficult. But, you know... You are growing, you are evolving, and you want to make sure that you continue and stay down that path because change is hard, and it's really hard when you don't have that support. So I encourage you to really keep growing, keep moving forward because, you know, it feels good. It feels good for you. So I would love to hear your comments about this. Leave me a comment below. Thanks, and have an amazing Wednesday.